right. Up next, we got our man Emery Emery. We talked to Coach Emery when he was taking over for Lexington Catholic. And here they are, the into the regional. They won the region and they're going to the state championship. Coach Emery, how you doing, man? I'm doing great. Thanks for having me on the show. Yes, sir. So what are you doing to get the girls ready for this champion, this state per tournament? I just doing what we what we've been doing. Uh trying to trying to be our best when we go out there. Hey, Coach. Coach, man, impressive season so far. First of all, I gotta talk about Amy, uh, Abby Hammond, a freshman. Yeah. Betting 520, 12 home runs. Not only is she doing that, she's also your top pitcher. Uh, yeah. She's you name it. Be she impressive. <laughs> She'd be our leader in stolen bases, too, if I let her run. <laughs> she's a one man game, Cole. Oh, man. You get a dozen of her and look out. Well, you also no, got she's... another young lady behind her, but I know it's familiar to new. Familiar to you, Abby Emery at Benton 381, doing her thing as well. She's had yeah. three home ones. Coach, you got a lot of talent up and down this roster and to be so young. Yeah, we're uh we've got next year we'll have seven of our nine starters back, and six of those seven are sophomore and under right now. So um yeah, we we should be good for a couple of years, provided everybody stays healthy and we keep working. Now, the 11th region, you know, Henry Clay has had a lot of dominance in this region, but you guys have been doing big things. It seems like it's kind of like you and Lafayette these last couple seasons have been really going at it. You know, Lafayette went far into the tournament last season. How are you guys going to advance in this tournament? How are you taking on this tournament? Well, um, first of all, how about Lafayette? What a great team. I mean, that, you know, we thought we had them beat a couple times and they just kept coming back. I mean, they – they made it as hard as you can be. So to prepare us for what we're going to see, um, that's part of it. You face competition like that and just uh, keep plugging away. That helps you out, I think, in the long run. Um, so we're going to you know, go have the same approach. Um, just go after them and try to stay at it. Keep the, keep the foot on the gas. Well, the follow-up with Coach Trump said as well, like I said, every time you played Lafayette, it was a close game, which you won majority of them. I think you got they beat you in the district for the championship, but you came right back around uh, and and, clip, and uh, clipped them in the uh, eleven region championship. So, yeah, how was you able to keep your girls up for every single game against this Lafayette team, even though you had success against them? Well, you know they get up for us, we get up for them. Uh, a lot of those girls grew up playing ball together, playing uh, rec ball and then travel ball together. They know each other, so. You know, they get up to play each other. It's uh, back and forth. You know, every time we play, it's, it's always a battle. It's a fun game. We were fortunate to come out on top. Um, we gave them our best shot, and they, they took it and gave us their best shot, and we took it. So, you know, we, it was back and forth. We were one, well, it was one play away. Uh, Ava hit a grand slam, and that was the difference in the game. And usually when we're playing them, it's, that's the difference in the game. One, one hit, one play. That's the difference in the game. Well, we want to wish you guys best of luck. You know, represent Lexington well in this tournament, Coach, and uh, keep doing big things, Lexington Catholic, Coach. Well, thank you. Thanks for having me on. I was having some technical difficulties earlier, but I'm glad that uh, you guys asked me to be on. I very much appreciate it. All right. Thanks, thank Coach. You, Coach. Good luck to you. Thank you for having us on, too. All right. Thank you. Yes, sir. All right.